let's just talk about uh, luxury listing presentations, okay. right? Yeah. So, so give us an example of like, you're going on a big appointment. What kind of preparation do you do on the seller, on the house, on the neighborhood, more than just pulling the comps, right? Like give us like, just walk us through like a typical, hey, I'm going on that appointment. It's a 7 million, 10 million, okay. 20 million, 100 million, whatever the price is. So when it's I got expensive. my first $3 million listing, I had spent years, my high sale before that was 5 million. Mm -hmm. But I'd spent years, we have care, Broker Caravan, which I go to every Tuesday and I yeah. looked at all the houses. And Why do you do that? You have to know what you're selling. Oh, okay. Preparation, <laughs> good. Just and checking. I remember I had a friend in the office, she was in the business for 45 years, she was older. Mm -hmm. She'd come with me on Caravan because I wanted a friend to come with me. Yeah. And she'd say to me, why are you wasting your time looking at all these five, 10, $15 million houses? You don't have buyers for that. I said, I may not today, but if I do tomorrow, I know what to show them. Bingo. So. You know, my high sale was five million, I could, but I, and I would be invited because I was known to the big, big private showings of like twenty million. There weren't mm -hmm. a lot of twenty millions in those days, yeah. and um, so I got the call for this listing appointment, and I knew it was a very expensive one. So I, I was mentally prepared, and every caravan I would get the brochures, and I had literally um, those three ring binders with the plastic mm -hmm. sheets. I had mm -hmm. the brochures, and I had Homeby Hills one, I had Bel Air one, I had all the brochures, and I would of all these. the cities. No, no, of, of the actual brochures of the houses. Yes, yes, yes. but I mean, meaning you pick them up by area. In, in Bel Air, yeah. in yeah. Beverly Hills, in Beverly Hills Flats, yeah. and, right? And I so, them yes. all because I thought if I'm getting a big listing, I know how to do it. So, um, so that I got the mm. call at eight thirty in the morning at the office on a Sunday. This is cell phones, were, iPhones weren't even out yet, right? And they said we want you to come tomorrow. We're going to be leaving the country. We're going to sell the house. And they were friends. Even though I was mentally prepared, he was a major businessman. He had uh, made his company go public, and he sold it for like four hundred million dollars and bought this. At the time, he bought it for like sixteen million for his wife for their wedding gift, mm -hmm. and then they were selling it ten years later. So, I was mentally prepared. I knew the comps, but I wanted to be prepared for any objection he had. Mm -hmm. I spent eight hours preparing a really great presentation. Eight hours I spent that. Give day. us an example of what was in it. Oh, comps, specific marketing plan and letter, and all that stuff. And I brought all that stuff. And the wife didn't meet. It was we met at eight thirty the next morning. It was just me and him. I'd been to the house. I didn't walk through it. We sat in the entryway of the house on a little sofa. And I literally, and I going back to that more and more, I didn't show anything. Mm -hmm. I said, Steve, yeah. do you absolutely have to sell your home? <laughs> I swear Bill to Pipes gosh, would be so proud. The, the five minute, the 10 minute, right, the 20 minute. Right, right, yes. Says, well, yes, he says, you know, we're, we're moving out of the country. You know, it was October in yeah. July, because, you know, we're moving out of the country. I said, great. Are you willing to price your home to, to sell? sell? And he says, well, what price do you think it should be? I said, it's, it's worth 23 to 24 Wait, you million. didn't do, I study homes and prices every day. So I assume that, remember that, remember yes, that script? I, 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 we're like, we're like really dating ourselves right now. I said that right afterwards, now. yeah. Yes. So he, I said, it's worth 23 to 24 million. Yeah. So what should we listen for? It says 26.5. Mm -hmm. He says, no, I'm listed for 30 million. I said, okay. I said, if I sell your home in the next 30, 60 days, is that okay with you? He says, no, because the kids are in school. We're not leaving till July. Got it. I said, okay. So then if that's the case, I need a one-year listing agreement, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And this took a lot of guts. I had written in the contract 6% commission. Yes. And he says, how much is your commission? I said, 6%. Yeah. And he says to me, I'm only paying you $1 million to sell this house. Mm -hmm. So I scratched it out. I wrote in $1 million. We sold a year and two months later for $23.5 Yeah. And he paid a $1 million. That's amazing. Because that's what he said.